order to simulate IoT networks and devices, we will use the Contiki operating system and the Kuja simulator that is bundled with it. In this video, we will see an overview of the functionalities provided by the Kuja simulator. This is the initial window that is shown when the Kuja simulator is executed. Kuja uses an XML formatted file to represent the simulation, including the simulated devices, the topology of the network, and the connections between the devices. When Kuja is executed without the specific simulation file as a parameter, this empty interface is shown. We can open a ready-made simulation by navigating to the file menu, selecting Open Simulation, and then clicking on Browse. In the provided virtual machine, we navigate to the folder named Part 3, Contiki Intro, Simulations, 00-Overview, and then select the file named overview-kuja.csc. A loading progress bar will display briefly, and when it's done, the interface will contain multiple new windows, each presenting and or controlling a different aspect of the simulation. In the network window, there are two numbered circles, each representing an IoT device called Motes within Contiki and Kuja. Clicking on one selects it, for example device 2, and as a result the range of non-interfering communication is shown in green, and the interference range in grey. The reception link quality from node 2 to node 1 is also shown, here it is 100%. In the simulation control window, we can click on the start button to start executing the simulation. And we can then click on the pause button to pause it. It is also possible to change the speed of simulation by selecting the speed limit menu and changing the selection. For example, select no speed limit and press start. You will notice that uh, time passes by much faster. Press pause again. The speed of the simulation will vary with the processing power of the computer you are using in this case. Once the simulation has started executing, messages start appearing in the mode output window with each line being the output from one device. The time column represents the time of creation of the message, the mode column represents the ID of the device that generated it, and the message column contains a message produced. It is possible to write case-sensitive regular expressions in the text box at the bottom of this window to filter the messages. For example, write address and press enter to get only the messages with this content. To clear the filter after use, delete the filter contents and press Enter. In the Power Tracker window, we can see the percentage of time spent in each radio state for each IoT device. For example, the radio is in the ON state 100% of the time for both devices 1 and 2. In the Radio Messages window, we can see all the packets sent and received through the simulated radio interfaces. If we select a packet, for example packet number 884, we can see a basic breakdown of the packet structure at the physical, MAC and routing layer, similar to what we get with the Wireshark program. The columns also indicate the time that the packet was sent at, the ID of the sending device and of the receiving devices, and the size of the data sent. Selecting a packet, for example packet 886, and then pressing space, updates both the mode output window and the timeline window to as close as possible to the packet send time. In the timeline window, it is possible to see a timeline of the radio operation. Clicking on each color reveals information about the type and time of radio operation. For example, clicking and holding on the gray part shows that device 2 turned on the radio hardware. Clicking and holding on the blue part shows that device 1 started actively transmitting and clicking and holding on the green part shows that device 2 started receiving. It is possible to zoom in and out of the timeline by selecting the zoom menu and then for example zoom out but also by typing for example control minus. Finally, once we are done with the simulation we can select the file menu entry and then exit or directly click on the X button at the top.